know how the Middle East cracks down on women really hard? Yeah, they cover up, don't let them do stuff. Uh huh. I have a theory here. This video I like to call, how can I blame women for this? Cracking down on women gets worse in the Middle East when Western women are acting up the most. Are you connecting the dots like I am? Show them how bad it can get. Yeah. Are you guys following the bouncing ball? Our Western liberal women weren't so embarrassing. The Muslims wouldn't be cracking down on women because they're so scared their women are gonna turn into our women. I actually think that's a fair assessment. But here in the Middle East, they promote propaganda constantly. Endlessly broadcasting Western feminist videos to really drive the fear home. Where did I get my source? Trustmebro.com. It's almost like progressive liberal women's fault for whatever's happening in the Middle East. <laughs> So I think politics is a complete joke and it's just another way to divide the people. Sure, it's a theory, but this video is evidence to back it up. You dislike your political opposition so much, you're gonna blame them for circumstances in other countries that they have no association with. They That's look right. over here, what we're doing here, we're celebrating abortion, girls are guys, everyone's naked in the street in front of the kids. This video is in no way me commenting on the current political state in the USA. I don't live in America, so I have no interest. But this sounds like somebody who's spending too much time on the internet. Being fed bias agendas. They're like, he's in his twink outfit. President of Ukraine who stayed in his country to fight back against the Russian invasion? Yeah, what a twink. Worse our women, our Western progressive women get, the worse the Muslim women get treated because they're so scared of their women becoming our I think our that's women. fair. I think the more that we give microphones out to white boys, the worse the opinions get. I think that's a fair assessment. Ooh, another white boy with a podcast.